Stretching for thousands of miles below our feet, Earth's subsurface is a world where geological processes occur that have the potential to affect all of our lives. Understanding this world is important, and researchers at NETL are monitoring what elements are present in specific underground formations. This is an excellent indicator of what's happening in the subsurface. It's information that will help keep us safe and enable sustainable energy production. Obtaining information about the subsurface can be difficult. Traditional subsurface monitoring activities require traveling to a site where a hole has been drilled and physically pulling a sample from the downhole environment. But the subsurface is much different than the world above ground. Elements found there can be indicative of leakage, contamination, or ore deposits and may undergo undesirable chemical changes when brought to the surface. Any alteration can affect how accurately the composition can be analyzed and can make it more difficult to determine the exact geochemical conditions in the downhole environment. NETL researchers are working on a technology that can take measurements like these without the need to remove the sample. They will accomplish this by deploying an optical sensor into the downhole environment. This sensor communicates to the surface via a fiber optic cable. Because the NETL sensor contains no electronics and is all optical, it can survive the extreme conditions of the downhole environment. To determine what elements are present underground, the device creates a pulse of light that is amplified and focused to make a spark in the water being measured. The spark emits light in all directions, creating characteristic atomic emission and is then back transmitted through the device. The light then travels up the optical fiber to the surface. Topside, this light is analyzed by a spectrometer to determine what elements are present. This analysis provides crucial information that can be used for many different applications that are critical for safe, sustainable energy production, and to protect the environment. Researchers are working to develop this technology in the laser laboratory at NETL's Pittsburgh site. Among the world-class research team are eager members of the next generation of scientists who have come to NETL to work on the world's most cutting-edge technologies. Hi, my name is Ted Bart, PhD student at Mississippi State University in the Applied Physics. I work in laser-induced breakdown spectroscopy or material characterization. I came to NETL in 2016 fall as an Horizon intern. I came here to get new experience and exposure because it has a NETL has a very big name as a research institution. Overall, I'm very happy I got this chance to be here and to work with world-leading scientists from the globe. What we do is we use laser light to heat on the samples to get light from them like that and we analyze those spectra to find the information about the samples like what kind of elements are there and how much they are. This is what we do here. Work on NETL's downhole laser technology will support cross-cutting efforts throughout NETL including carbon storage, enhanced oil recovery, and rare earth element research. Once fully developed, this technology will benefit Americans by providing the accurate analysis of elements from within their environments. This kind of analysis may help to check for CO2 leakage at carbon storage sites, ensure water quality in both aquifers and water treatment facilities, and help to identify rare earth elements that are critical components to the technologies we rely on every day from computers to cell phones. Theoretically, this laser sensor could even be used in space to identify valuable elements in passing asteroids, a type of mission that NASA has considered. This technology has been successfully employed on the latest Mars rover as the ChemCam device and will be deployed again on the Mars 2020 mission. Whether it's found deep underground or in the coldness of space, NETL's downhole laser sensor is poised to revolutionize the way researchers monitor subsurface environments, providing a high degree of accuracy previously unattainable.